Hi, welcome back to the J Network Sports Talk Hour. I'm Jake Johnston here with Jake Adams and Jack Arthur. And uh, today we'll be discussing the MLB playoff picture and bids for the MVP award. All right, so Jack, you want to start us off? Um, yeah, I think that um, the Yankees will probably be the number one seed in the AL. Yes, uh, the Yankees and the Twins are, right now the Twins are four games back for the number one seed in the AL right now. And the wild card spot in the AL is being battled by, by four teams, the uh, Red Sox, Indians, Athletics, and uh, Angels. Um, honestly, I think um, the p- team that are going to get into the wild card for the AL is going to be the Red Sox and the Angels because Mike Trout's shown he can really put their team on the back, especially last night, making that throw from center field all the way home. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, and for AL MVP, I'm going to have to go with Mike Trout. That's the obvious choice. I mean, really, there's nobody else in mm-hmm. contention. He He's like top, he's top five in just about every stat mm-hmm. and number one in RBIs and home runs. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, I'd probably say him because he's good at fielding, he's good at hitting, he's just a good all-around player. Yeah, and I think that the Red Sox will beat the Angels in the wild card round, go on to play the Yankees, and I think that the Red Sox will lose to the Yankees. Yeah, um, I'd have to agree with you there. I mean, the Angels, Trout can put his team on his back, but I don't think that will happen in the playoffs. And then the Yankees are just too good. They're probably going to cruise through the World Series, honestly. Oh, Yankees we have a caller. Yeah, we're first caller. Hey, guys, love the show. Uh, obviously, the Yankees have been playing pretty well lately. Uh, if you were running the Yankees, would you uh, make a trade at the deadline and try to add a piece? And if so, what would you try to do? If I were the Yankees, I would probably for the season sickle what they have. They are doing outstanding so far this year, having kind of a record-setting year for them. They are currently 30 games above 500. I so. mean, there's no real really need to make a move. It's not like they're just beating bad teams last night. They put, Their whole team, they really don't have a weakness. Their whole team played great around against the Twins, some great diving catches there. The Yankees are just all around good. They don't need to change anything up. Well, they're already pretty stacked, so I don't think they should buy or sell. They've got, like, good players in each position, and they don't really need to go after anybody. Yes, and I think the Yankees will go on to beat the Twins and end up, end up in the World Series. And then quickly, let's do our um, NL predictions. Who do you have as the one seed? Uh, for the one seed, I actually have the Dodgers because oh. currently the Dodgers are seven games above the Braves for the number one seed. And I have the um, Cardinals coming in at the wild card spot. Uh, They will go ahead and play the Dodgers, and I have the Dodgers winning. I have the Dodgers beating the Braves, and then the Dodgers ending up in the World Series. I mean, I actually had the Cubs taking the one seed, and then um, the Phillies and the Nationals as your wild cards, but the Phillies actually, I think, would beat the Cubs in the second round, but then um, lose to the Dodgers and have the Dodgers move on to the World Series. Yes. So, so, should we just quickly do our NL MVPs? Mm-hmm. Uh, I got Yelich. He's yes. just an all-around great player, just like Trout. But I'm going to have to go with Cody Bellinger on this one. He's an all-around great player, but he, I think he has more power. So I have to go Christian Yelich or um, someone that nobody's really talking about, Josh Bell on the Pirates. He's hit 27 home runs and has about 70 RBIs. And if he just steps it up a little bit, he can be a contender. And last but not least, who is going to win the World Series? I have the Yankees. Yankees. Dodgers. Okay, signing off. That's the J Network Sports Radio Hour. Thanks for watching.